Hey guys, my name is Pam Frank. I'm the manager of Cayenne Dialysis. We are so excited to be having this fundraiser on Friday, May 29th called Powered the Pedal. We're going to be down at County Physical Therapy on some stationary bikes, peddling for our patients to raise money for some new equipment for the dialysis unit. You know, people ask me all the time, what's dialysis all about? They hear that people come here, but they're not even really sure what we do. So come on into the unit and I'll show you. This is some of our staff. Say hi. People sometimes think that dialysis is just for the elderly, and that really isn't true at all. We take care of adults of all ages. We have an 18-year-old patient all the way up to 90-year-old patients here. So the patients we take care of have chronic kidney failure, which means they've been seeing their doctors for a period of years, and they've watched their kidney functions get worse and worse, to the point where they need to come to us to have treatment. Some of them have kidney cancers, some are born with it, it's genetic, some it's a medication that they may have taken that has destroyed their kidneys, but the majority of our patients um, receive treatment because they have either high blood pressure or diabetes. Those are the two main causes of kidney failure. So to do the actual dialysis process, we insert two needles, one to pull the dirty blood and one to return the clean blood. So the dirty blood comes along through the tubing and over our dialysis machine, the dirty blood comes to the pump, which just pushes the blood around for us. It comes down through a couple of these chambers, which are safety chambers to make sure that there's no air in a person's blood. And then it travels over to this. This is called a dialyzer, which is actually an artificial kidney. This is where all the work really happens. All of the toxins and the waste particles and extra fluid that your kidneys remove because you have healthy kidneys, this one removes all of this for our patients. The clean blood then comes out through goes through one more safety chamber just to make sure there's no air and then it's returned the clean blood back to the patient. This process of pulling out the blood, cleaning it and returning it back to the patient goes on over and over again for usually about four hours and they come here three times a week in order to receive these treatments. Our patients come from all over Rooster County, from Holton, Hodgson, all the way to Fort Kent and Madawaska, and all the towns in between. Come on, I'll introduce you to a couple of them. Hello, my name is David Plod. I live in Westfield. I've been coming to Dialas for almost two years. Um, yeah, you know, it uh, keeps me going, and uh, keeps me with my family. And, uh, we get a bunch of grandkids now, so it makes it a lot of fun. And, uh, you know, it's just, without it, it's, you know, you're in a box. You're in a fine box. You know, so we keep them going. I'm glad they're here. Because if not, you're a rough road somewhere else, I would think. Uh, I'd rather stay here. I'm glad it's here. Hi, I'm Jim Driscoll, and uh, we live in Presque Isle. And, I've been coming to county dialysis for three and a half years, and it's been wonderful to live right here. If it wasn't for this, we'd be traveling to Bangor, or I'd be doing the home CAPD. So I thank and I'm very thankful that this center is here. My wife, uh, Sandy, has been by my side every step of the way. The center here. It has been his lifeline, our lifeline. Um, it, being here means that um, we don't have to go to Bangor, we don't have to move there. It allows me to work. And it's just been great, all the staff and everybody's been great for us. Happy dialysis.